Hi guys, welcome from Queensland, Australia. This is our new wind generator from JCAR Electronics. Its specs are as follows. It's a 200 watt nominal output generator. Its maximum output is 300 watts. Its output is three phase. It's mounted about 4.5 meters high and it's about 120 feet from the house and the batteries. It's feeding into a 12 volt battery bank of 400 ampere hour full river sealed AGMs. The system of course is 12 volt. Originally we had 80 inch diameter blades, now we've got 70 inch diameter blades. This is just a little video just to show you what you can really expect from a wind generator. Changed from the 80 inch original blades, uh, which were fiberglass, to the new 70 inch extruded aluminium blades because there was an imbalance with the fiberglass blades we couldn't get rid of uh, easily. Uh, also, uh, there is a difference in uh, output and noise from these two different blade sets, as you'll see. As you can hear, there's virtually no noise at all coming out of it. You could have ten of those in your backyard and no one could complain. it's swinging around there quite a bit. It's uh, gustily westerlies today, um, tending towards the southwest and unfortunately the house and the rain tanks are in the way. There she is in full flight. That's uh, pushing out 20 odd amps, 22 amps today. Wind gusts up around 12 meters per second. And the highest wind so far this morning has been a constant 8.2 metres per second. So it's doing quite well. Like I say, the wind only comes from this direction for one month of the year. The rest of the time it comes out of the southeast. Uh, that's why the windmill is where it uh, was put. I say virtually no sound at all. Cheap as chips too. Wind generator was uh, five hundred dollars from Jayco in Australia. She's bouncing around a bit because of the turbulence from the house.